<laughs> what school do you go to? <laughs> I go to Pentucket Regional High School. And how old are you? <laughs> I'm 16. Why do you need a service dog? I have a service dog because I have type 1 diabetes, so basically what Dice does is she will tap me like or jump on me when my blood sugar goes too high or too low. What is diabetes? So diabetes is when your pancreas stops like producing insulin, which causes your levels to go crazy like when you like eat certain foods and yeah. <laughs> what is it like living with diabetes? Um, so it's pretty much the same living with diabetes. You just have to be like more careful of what you do and like what you eat. You just like remember what you're doing and I have to like take insulin and check my blood sugar levels. But besides that, it's like pretty much the same. <laughs> what is it like bringing a dog to school? It's fun bringing a dog to school. It was really like kind of weird at first, but now I'm just kind of used to it. Is it hard to prevent other students from touching dice? Um, it was kind of hard like at first, but now everyone kind of knows she's not to pat her. The only one who really pats dice is Mr. Evans. <laughs> who is Mr. Evans? <laughs> Mr. Evans is the assistant principal. <laughs> Does it bother you when other students touch dice? Um, it doesn't really bother me. It just like, it just can kind of like distract dice, but it's okay. <laughs> What does the dog vest do? The vest lets the dice know that she's working. How is dice different at home versus at school? Um, dice is pretty much the same when her vest is on, like at home or at school. But when I take her vest off at home, she's really crazy and she, <laughs> she's like acts like a regular dog. How old is dice? Dice is two. What do you do when Dice has to go to the bathroom? Um, well, I just like kind of regularly take Dice out throughout the day. Like I take her in between fourth and fifth period. Does bringing Dice outside to go to the bathroom ever affect your schedule? No, because it's really quick. Because she has like a command, I just tell her to go to the bathroom and she'll go. <laughs> how does Dice know how to help you? Um, Dice can smell like when my blood sugar levels get too high or low and she'll tap me when I'm going too low or too high and when I'm low she'll just like make sure I do what I'm supposed to do. Yeah. <laughs> do you and Dice walk up the stairs or take the elevator? We walk up the stairs. <laughs> How have the other students reacted to a dog in their school? Pretty much like everyone's reacted kind of differently but most people find it really cool and they like having a dog in school. How did the administration of Pentucket react to you bringing a dog to school? Um, well, we told the school like um, like a year in advance that we were bringing Dice to school, and they were okay with it. What was your initial reaction when McKenna asked to bring Dice to school? I was curious, and I was just sort of not sure how it was all going to work, because it was really the first time that we'd done anything like that. And I certainly knew about service dogs, but um, I, I guess I had probably as many questions as uh, the Sheds did, as McKenna did, as, as anybody would have. Um, so I was kind of like wondering how it would all work out. How do you think having a service dog at Pentucket has affected everyday life? Um, well, I think it's done a lot for people to learn about service dogs. That many people probably didn't really know that much about. Like you maybe had seen one somewhere, but um, maybe didn't really know anybody who had a service dog. I certainly was true for me. Um, so I think it has helped to uh, educate people about how dogs can help um, and um, probably you know increase everyone's like sensitivity towards you know, others that have needs and, and how we can help them. Does Dice sleep with you at night? She does. <laughs> was it hard to focus the first few weeks of having Dice in school? It was just like different and I was like, I don't know, I just wasn't really used to it. Like, I kind of forgot that I had dog with me, but I'm used to it now. <laughs>